What's going on, Legion? Azure here, like always, and, well, Nicolas Cage. Anybody like him still? I love him. I want there to be a movie that's not like Ghost Rider. Please. And I want this to be good. Let's just get straight into it. Check it out, Mom and Dad. Let's fucking go. Fucking, come on. Oh, I want this to be good. I want this to be good so bad. I want him to... He's gone from being a badass to, like, a funny badass. Hey, uh, can I go to a movie with Riley tonight? With Riley? Your grandparents are coming for dinner tonight, remember? Awesome. Riley's oh. telling his disgusting Vietnam stories. Take my advice. Don't ever have kids. Everything just revolves around you, doesn't it? Like Mr. and Mrs. Yeah, Smith. <laughs> Are their parents going to try to kill them? Well, this is exactly the opposite of what I thought it was. I thought this was going to be like some kind of crazy Mr. and Mrs. Smith kind of thing, but like low budget and crappy, because that's Nicolas Cage now. Um, what the hell did I just watch? Why did I watch it? What's going on? This was like a weird zombie, but not zo This is like zombies with minds still. Oh, that's what I was going to say. What was it, The Knowing? What's the Mark Wahlberg movie? I'm pretty sure uh, it is called, like, The Knowing. I'm going to take the moment right here to look that up. Because let's just do this. We have to we have to experience this movie together. I need to tell you this. So, Mark Wahlberger, however you spell his fucking weird-ass name. Uh, let's go to his movies real quick. Uh, let's. We have to experience this movie as a group, as, as a team here. I need I need to show you uh, the Italian job. No, 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 no combination. For the happening. There it is. The happening. So if you don't know what the happening is, let's see if I can. Uh, the happening right here. The happening. An apocalyptic threat to humanity arrives out of the clear blue sky with a series of violent, unexplicable deaths spreading across the country. The cause of the terrifying phenomenon remains unknown, prompting science, uh, science teacher Elliot Moore, Mark Wahlberg, his wife, Alma uh, Zoe de Chanel, funny enough, uh, and his college, uh, or his colleague, J John Leguizamo, uh, Zamo, uh, to try to elude the invisible killer in Pennsylvania's farmland, soon to become clear no one is safe. Now, that's the perfect picture right there. Uh, no, it's not. Um, where's that asshole with a lawnmower? Or is there's that scene right there where the people jump off. So this, what we just watched, reminds me of this. One of the worst acting jobs in any movie I've ever seen in my life. Right fucking here. These three scenes right here. Show it all. This is the one where the air was your enemy. They were running from gusts of wind. And what I mean by that is that when Mother Nature tries to kill something or tries to make an antibody for something, uh, yeah, um, 
that's what happens. And, and so it's doing that to humanity. There was no effect for any villain or anything. It was literally trees blowing. That was, oh no, the disease could be fly. How do you run from a fucking disease? It's like pollen. So that's no joke. You just take out the fact that it's air killing people and you act and you take away the bad acting of Mark Wahlberg not being a badass because he can be a badass. But when he's like, oh my God, what's going on? That's how he acts. And you, you put in Nicolas Cage and you just give one uh, 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 and you add comedy to it, which God, I wish Mark Wahlberg's movie would have been com uh, comedic. This movie looks almost the exact same. It's just parents going crazy, like rabies instead of pollen. I don't know what's going on with some movies, but at least this one looks like it's going to be funny. Like, I, I don't, I don't really know what else to say. I'm, I'm honestly lost. And I know it's supposed to be funny, but it didn't really grab me as something hilarious. It looked pretty good. Like, it looked, a, it, it gave me a chuckle. But like, is it supposed to be like hilarious, or is this another? Nicolas Cage still in bankruptcy movie. You know, I'm like, where's Ghost Rider 3? That should be coming out soon, right? Um, I'll check this out just because I love Nicolas Cage. Always have. Um, if you haven't seen Face Off, do yourself a favor and watch one of the greatest movies of like the 90s ever. Like, hands down, it's back when Travolta wasn't all Scientology and, and collagen and weird. Uh, and he wasn't just a freak and touching male masseuses. I don't know what the fuck's happening to some of the people that I, I, I watched growing up. But some of them are fucking weirdos. Um, yeah, just just do yourself a favor and check that out. But with that, I think we're going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Like the video, like the content. Like, subscribe, share. Remember, it's going to be up to you. I do appreciate it. Though, do, though, does help me out some way or another. You want to comment down below. Love to see love to hear all the comments. Once again, my name is Azrael. I'll see you in whatever video I'm doing next. Later, guys.